I'm 22 years old, standing in my first New York apartment, empty, save the rustle of roommate's footsteps. Amble alone beneath the Friday streetlight. Mumble out loud to no one that the lips here all curl into yells or kisses. Have a drink in a bar in Murray Hill, because I don't know shit about New York. <laughs> Dreamscape, Fever City, Ferocity Block, and the months pass like minutes, even in winter, because we were young. Yes, lightning quick, but also glacial, icebergs, the lot of us, intimidating but drifting, chunks of ourselves sloughing off into the cold water of who we once were, somehow sprinting always, even indoors, at night, in rhythm, in sweat, next to strangers, running the same direction toward warmth or its closest approximation, a new body, a buzz of a crackling speaker, sprinted across the river, chasing a version of ourselves always out of our grasp. Sprinted underground, listened to poetry, watched Mahogany L. Brown from the back row, stayed out with John Sands and Adam Faulkner who looked taller up close, crammed inside a too small booth, talked about the work, wondered to myself, but never aloud, will I make it here? Which is what we say when we are too afraid to ask well, I belong here. And that night, we laughed loud on a street corner like I had heard so many nights before from my own bed, sometimes laughing alone in the empty room like I got the joke until finally I did or I made the joke or I was the joke and it didn't matter. Perhaps family is when you stop keeping score or auditioning warmth no longer a precious metal. And a decade passes, and I'm able to stand clock tower still. At rest, my friends, a bouquet of unruly flowers, their pollen all over my hands. And in that, I am leaving. My love and I pack our life in the new silence of daylight. The laugh outside my window, not mine, comforting haunting. We stand in an empty room we used to call bed. In an empty city we used to call home. Spring blooms. We wonder if we'll ever belong anywhere else. Thank you.